Hey, what's up YouTube and welcome back to the channel. As far as we receive a new jailbreak and I'm talking here about the Uncover and the Chimera jailbreak starting from iOS 11 up to 12.2. So let's go ahead and talking about some tweaks for that new jailbreak. Before I'm going to be start today's video, let me ask you guys to give the video a big thumbs up. Also make sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell so you will be notified always whenever I release a tweaks video. So the first one I will be talking about is Sylvia and once you want to download the tweak, that tweak will be make some changes on Cydia. So if you want to launch Cydia application, you want to go to the changes here or if you want to just update your Cydia, you will be see most the icons here. Even if you want to install to remove the tweak, you will be see most the things it looks like this on your Cydia application. Even if you receive any kind of upgrade, you will be see that actually on the icon in every single tweak. So if the tweak it's a new, it will tell you it's a new tweak. If the tweak wants an upgrade, it will tell you to upgrade the tweak. So this is the way about that tweak, which is in my opinion it's really beautiful to have that stop inside Cydia. So as I told you guys talking about the Sylvia, this is the way about that tweak and this is the most things about the tweak once you want to install it and this is the most changes once you open your Cydia application. Go ahead and try Sylvia. Next one I will be talking about the full folder X and what is that week will be provide you with I think the name just explain himself so once you want to launch any one of the folders that you have on your iDevice the full folder will be open wild on the screen. So if we go ahead right now and jump under the settings to see what we have there. So this is the full folder settings here we have one of the toggles here in the top which is if you want to hide the folder title also we have a couple of sliders you can adjust some stuff if you want to and some other stuff if you want to adjust those here and make sure once you're done from all that stuff you need to make sure to resupring your device so your device will be take the effect and this is the way about the full folder x on your device let's jump right now to talking about the next tweak i'll be talking about the bubbles and what is the bubbles will be make for your device or what the tweak will be provide you with it will be make the messages app a more modern and the looks beautiful so i'm about to show you guys what i mean here if i want to launch my messages app here you will be see different kind of colors also the blur and most style stuff that we have under the messages application i use for that the bubbles so if we go ahead right now and jump under the settings to so talking about the most of things that we have under the settings here go ahead and enable the tweak and also we have the dark or the light mode and also here we have the light configuration you can just stop on here and you will be go to a lot of different kind of stuff and also colors i already changed my background here so you can pick that from in there and also there is a ton of stuff as i told you guys so you can go through and then you can customize a lot of things with bubbles after you are done from all the configuration just make sure to resupring your device so your device will be take the effect and this is the way about the bubbles anyway as i told you guys this is what the tweak will be provide you with so i highly recommend you guys to give it a try that's if you like to change some stuff on your messages application go ahead and download the bubbles Next CD tweak, I will be talking about the new tweak, the notification, which is will be bring a really beautiful and nice effect once you want to receive any kind of notification on your iDevice. If I want to show you guys and giving you an idea how is that going to be looks like, this is the way here and we have more than that style. So if you go under the settings, you can pick uh, more than the style you have there you can pick your favor from there and i'm about to show you guys some other styles from under the settings okay so if you want to purchase for that week 
go ahead and download the tweak you can get the tweak from the big boss repo which is will be in the description down below after you download the tweak if you want to know how you can purchase for this one go ahead launch the tweak go under the settings there is a pop-up message telling you if you want uh, to purchase for the tweak so you will be allowed to use most of the things also the animation and also most of the things under the settings so you can simply just stop on to it and that's going to be cost you a couple bucks but anyway as i told you guys so we are right now here under the settings to showing you guys some other stuff and what we have here under the settings so first of all we have here the lock screen so you can enable that notification tool be pop up on your lock screen also we have more than option but the one that i already told you guys and talking about it which is going to be the animation section here so if you top on it as i told you it's more than one and there is a lot of stuff also we have here the notification if you want to use those for the iphone x it will be available and for the non x devices also we have more than stuff but anyway as i told you guys so go ahead if you want to get that tweak let me know in the comment section below if you guys like it make sure to give it a try if you want to notification Let's talk right now about the next CD tweak that I have for you guys. This one's really excited. The Chrome Home Bar X, really beautiful one. So officially that tweak is going to be for the iPhone X, but it can work for the non X devices. You can install that if you run the little X tweak on your I device. So anyway, that tweak, once you want to install it, it will be giving you a really nice animation on your home bar. And if I want to show you guys what I mean here and how is that looks like after you download the tweak, you can take a look right now how is that gorgeous and beautiful if you want to download that tweak in your iDevice. As I told you guys, that tweak is going to be specific for the iPhone X, but it can be work with the non-X devices. So if we go ahead right now and jump under the settings, going to that tweak, as you might see right now, the first thing that you need to do, go ahead and enable the tweak. And also we have the style here, so you can choose your style. Also, we have another section if you want to pick the fade color, so you can change that. Also, we have the age color, so you can change that. And then you might see right now the way that I sit on my iDevice. So what I do here, I just leave everything on default and this is the way how is it looks like on your iDevice. If you want to change the colors, it's pretty simple. Just tap on the color and you can pick the color that you want to from in there. And after you're done, just make sure to resupring your device. After you resupring your device, everything will be work on your home bar on your iDevice. But anyway, as I told you guys, really beautiful tweak and I highly recommend it you guys to give it a try, the Chrome Home Bar X. So anyway guys, this is the most tweak that I want to share with you guys in today's video. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Don't forget, give the video a huge thumbs up and also make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you will be notified always whenever I release a new video. Catch you with the next one. Peace.